my name is Kasamomi. Um, I'm from London and I'm 41 years old. And I received the diagnosis of multiple sclerosis in 2008, even though things had triggered in 2002 for my allergic shock. And for six years, I didn't know what was going on. And my body was declining and pain up. And uh, when me and my family went for many alternative therapies, like acupuncture and Chinese medicine and stuff like that. And then um, after a while, Dr. Funny come to a conclusion that for you, because we was trying to ask them what was going on with you, you know, themselves. And then finally, they gave me diagnosis of MS. Mm -hmm. And what was the symptoms at the beginning when you found out about it? Um, in the beginning, there was a lot of um, misbalance. There was mm -hmm. a lot of balance out the way from side to side and stuff. And then uh, just over years, I started developing a weakness in like, the left side of my body. Like, um, my leg, I would swing up, swing my leg around me instead of walking step, step I would actually walk and then bring my other leg around. Mm -hmm. And like, I would receive a little bit missing. But my right hand, I'd be reaching a bone, my left hand, we kind of wish to refrain and stay back. How was the uh, decision came over to come over to um, Swiss Medica? Well, the stem cell therapy. A couple of years ago, I found out. I found out about it, and there was a lot of talk of people saying there was a lot of snake merchants online and stuff here. So I kind of let that let that idea go. And then my sister said, "Well, she kind of reminded me about it." Uh, she didn't even really remind me, so I looked into it again. And I read, well, I saw a number of testimonials, and I thought this sounds like a very serious thing. So I decided that I wanted to um, participate and find out what more I could do for myself. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. It's good. And uh, uh, how long you already staying with us? Which day? Um, I came here on the 12th of November. Um, um, like it's what now the 24th year. I spent my birthday here, which is on the 15th, and it was good. I mean, I've had like a concert pianist, and there was a lot of people that I came through with birthday cake and card and presents. I'm really thankful for that. It really put a smile on my face. So, now I really I got to spend my birthday in Russia, and because I've been on a huge journey for many, many years, now, now that I've come to like the pinnacle of the journey, I'm thinking that, yes, that everything is happening now at the right time. Okay, thank you very much. And uh, could you tell us um, how it's important to, uh, like you show to us, you, especially you have a book, how also it's important to believe in yourself in a com combination, um, also in that treatment? Well, for me personally, it's always been a thing where like, things have, um, Things have differentiated over the years, and uh, obviously, obviously, I've experienced a lot of weakness in my body and everything. Uh, I never let that stop me. I mean, for tomorrow, uh, if you can uh, tell us the um, proce yes, procedure well, to go to tomorrow. Basically, I uh, the stem cell therapy began on the 25th, which was yesterday, where they um, emboldened or enlarging the stem cells in my umbilical cord, in my um, yeah, in my stomach area, and then like tomorrow, um, is going to be another day where like they're going to take the stem cells from my adipose. umbilical cord and my adipose no, tissue. Adipose tissue. Oh, it's just mainly adipose. And also bone marrow. Yeah, yeah, adipose and bone marrow, and basically reinject it and like just get me back on my feet, which I'm really, really happy about. Absolutely, absolutely, you will. Okay. So before it was mis like a misunderstanding, right? Before you thought you uh, having the first procedure, it was uh, adipose and bone marrow, but the first procedure was umbilical cord. So you, you understand that? Yes, right? I, I, I understand uh -huh. now okay. that they started with the umbilical cord mm -hmm. and building up um, from my adipose tissue festival. So now I have a full understanding of everything. Okay, that's good. Cool. 
I've been coming here to Swiss Medica, been staying here for the past 21 days and um, things have been working out really well for me. I mean, now, previously before, I come in the MS which was in my body, was kind of playing up causing weakness on the left side of my body, um, on my left leg and my left arm. But since I've been treating now, there's six types of stem cells. My leg now feels more relaxed and I'm able to bend it more and so that my arm feels a bit more easier to move uh, with regards to the um, muscles in here. And all of that thing is just done really well. So but the stuff here have just been really, really excellent. Been very helpful and uh, they, they've like, just come in. Uh, some of like even help me eat my food or help me with washing and stuff. And like, it's just it's just so good. It's just so good here that like, in Moscow. And then I think the doctors are on an understanding level as well. You can speak to them and they have uh, like valuable information which they are willing to share with the patient as well. I speak to their colleagues in their own language. So this is really good and like I've started learning a little bit of Russian here. But now nah, this this is wicked. So I wanna say thank you to everybody, to Constantine, Dr. Pasini, Dr. Alexandra, and Marima, um Sveta, that's her name, you know that thing. Uh, to everyone, I just wanna thank everyone for my time here. And I wanna like, give a big thank you to my dad. And I want to shout out my two people who've come with me, and me that from being my sister. So, <coughs> my sister Sawa, who reminded me about this clinic, I looked into it before, and I disregarded it, but then she reminded me to look into it again. Another thing that I've noticed as well, well, what other people have noticed, and now I'm noticing it as well, is that since the treatment, my speech has now become more clearer more um, like understandable so I'm just looking forward to further and further developments so um, thank you all thank you Swiss Medica thank you family thank you friend and thank you all for supporting me and following my story on Facebook